Hello, I'm here on Church Street. It's Tuesday, windy afternoon. It's a busy afternoon. It's windy at the moment. Sun's out one minute, then it looks like it's going to rain the next. All the same, one thing that I am noticing more and more every day, and so will the people that visit the city centre, is the cultural change, right? The cultural change is so fast. It's even shocking me, right? It really, really is. It is so, it's happening so fast. And we have to ask ourselves, what do we plan to do about this? We can't just allow this state of affairs, right? Because as I said, once the new arrivals are in such numbers and they sink their roots so deep, they're in the driving seat, then we dance to their tune, right? That's what happens. We lose our Scouse ways. We lose our Scouse character, identity, tradition, values, standards, everything. Everything is changed. And everything dances to the tune of the new arrivals. Now, it's not me making this up. This has happened in many towns and cities across the country where they left it too late. Cultural change changed so much, it sank its roots in so deep. The new arrivals are now in the driving seat. And so we see this now happening on a daily basis in our glorious city. And that's why I need to bring this message to the good people of Liverpool. This is not prejudice, it's not hatred, it doesn't even come into it, right? What is happening is serious. We have so much in Liverpool to be proud of, so much to remember. It stretches back so long, we just can't afford to lose this in the way we are. Now, people may say, well, how are we gonna lose it, Joe? Well, go and walk in and around Kensington and Fairfield, Tubrook Old Swan, you will see there, it's losing its Scouse character, identity, culture, right? And as I've said, the city centre is a microcosm of cultural change in Liverpool city centre then. It's happening quicker than even I thought, right? Uh, busker over there and guitar, you got him, yeah, there he is. So, like I say, I come down here to the city centre at my own expense, my own time, effort, and I make these videos to bring it bring this message to the good people of Liverpool that our, our city is changing and it's changing fast I will be standing in the constituency of Wavertree in the next forthcoming general election that may be next May so it might be too far off so I need to start collecting funds and getting support and getting all the help that I know I'll need, right? So people there, they'll have a choice to vote for a candidate who's opposing the cultural change of our glorious city. I don't come down here, as I've said, just for the fun of it. I'm sure there's plenty of other things I could be doing, but I have to, because if I don't, no one else is gonna do it. And my city and the people I love, they're worth it. That's why I'm here most days of the week, right? The cultural change, like I've said, it's happening so fast. It is changing our city. And remember, there is no changing it back once it's gone. It's gone forever. Are we going to allow that to happen? We can't allow it to happen. We just can't, right? It's not an option. Anyway, I'm going to get back to enjoying some of the sights and sounds and coffee shops here in the city centre and try and relax for an hour or two and then maybe go home. But like I said, I bring this message to the good people of Liverpool because I care. I care about my city and I care about its future. I care about the children and grandchildren that if we don't stop this, are going to inherit this, this mess, this nightmare. We can't allow we can't allow it to happen, we just can't, right? So, 
pass my videos on, talk to your friends, family, work colleagues, and discuss and talk about the cultural change and its impact that it's going to have on our city, right? And like I've said before, the small Chinese black Hindu communities that settled here in Bryn, eh, sorry, here in Liverpool, because they were small in number, they fitted in. There wasn't, there isn't a problem. And those new arrivals that have made Liverpool their home, God bless them. Well, it's time now to, okay, mate, it's time to shut the door, right? It's time now to close the door, right? Okay, thank you.